I used to skateboard about four years ago. I was at my friend's house, we were skating, he's halfway, and my, his younger brother was like, dude, you should try rollerblade, and I was like, yeah, yeah, but then I tried to skate on, and I just like, immediately, I fell in love with skates, I just quit skateboarding, like, like that, just cold turkey, quit skateboarding, and then I just started skating, realized how much faster and how much higher you could get, it was, and then when I started skating, it was just so much fun. When I started off, I was about... 13 skating and uh, I got I bought a pair of Razor's Colt 3s I think they were for my friend who uh, he got a different pair of skates from someone else so he was just like oh yeah I'll sell you those and I was like oh yeah got an actual pair of skates so I skated those for like a couple months and then I was like it was my birthday came up and then Took all my money, bought the Latimer 2s. First time I used them, went to the Allegheny Skate Park and went to do like something on the halfway. I don't even remember what trick I was doing. Like I was just trying like a back rail or something. I caught my foot and just fell straight to the flat and broke my tooth. I just knocked it out of my fucking mouth. And it was like an adult one. So there was just a puddle of blood on the ground. And then I had to go, I just like, I got up, I just looked at my friend and I just like laughed. It was like, it was crazy. And then I went, I had to go to the dentist and they had to jam it back in my mouth. But I was, I was like, like that's why I rollerblade. And then like two months after that, I was skating. I went to do a handrail because I was like, oh, this handrail won't even be hard. I can do a handrail. So I went to do the handrail, I did the handrail, got to the bottom, there's a knob. I hit the knob. 180 off because I was like, oh, okay, I'm gonna fall. So if I like turn, I might be able to save myself. But there was a lip at the bottom of the step. So when I hit it, I just fell backwards, cracked my head out, knocked myself out. I had to go to the hospital and get like seven stitches in my head. And then, but the reason I keep skating is because when I fall, it just makes me want to get back up and do it. And just, just knowing that I'm that much closer to getting that trick that I've been trying that many times. And then, doesn't matter, there's no one around. I'm not doing it to be famous, you know. Doesn't <laughs> matter. Just wanna, just wanna have fun. <coughs> be free. That's what, I, that's what rollerblading is about, being you. Being yourself with no one around. It doesn't have to be what that person wants to tell you to do. It's not, you don't need a coach telling you what to do. It's cool when your friends are like, yeah, dude, you should try this. Be like, maybe, maybe. That's the reason you're not landing is because you got a friend with you that tells you what you're doing wrong, and they'll be like, "Oh, you're not, you're not spinning 90 degrees to lock that torque." A dream. It's not. It's not really to become famous, sponsored, like big. I I mainly I just love skating. Like I just want to skate with just like gnarliest dudes that they just love doing what they do. Like that's what it's about. It's not about getting paid, fucking stacking cash. It's about being happy and having fun doing what you do, you know? That's why I like all the pros, dude. I just, that'd be, that's, that's my dream, skate with the pro. That'd be, that'd be mad fun, you know what I'm saying? <laughs>
Def Lab is totally sick. <laughs> I'm not familiar. <laughs> One of my, you keep your stuff still filming, right? Yeah. One of my biggest pet peeves about the rolling scene, like people I roll with. People, I hate it when people like bitch about rolling. Like, if you think it's so stupid, don't, don't even bother. Like, there's no point in just hating on everything. Like, I hate it when people just point out all like the negative things. Like, look at the positive things about rolling and shit. Like, it's not about not being cool. Like cool things to do like people say it's so lame and like you can't even do anything with it and, like it's not even it's not even like popular like there's not even like that many people that do it so what just get out express go, yourself yeah express yourself just go roll like who cares what other people say like if you have you enjoy doing it it doesn't matter if it's not a big scene or there's a lot of people around you that do it, just go roll, find, find a ledge. You can find like small curbs on the sidewalk and you can grind those, you can grind those by yourself. That's what I used to do, I used to grind small rails by myself, man. I didn't mind it, it was fun, I enjoyed it. But I just hate it when people hate on everything. Like if someone doesn't land a trick, they're like, it's, it's a stupid trick. It does, like, it's not even cool. I mean, so what? Who cares? Enjoy what you do. When I walk into a skate park, carrying my skates, and I'm the only rollerblader, and I, I just look around and see, I don't see anybody else that rollerblades, it just makes me want to skate that much harder, just to show bikers and skateboarders like how much more gnarlier fucking rollerblading is than uh everything else like it just makes me want to skate that much harder to show that we can do ridiculous stuff and it's not sissy stuff like rollerblading sick I don't care what anybody else says. When you go into the skate park and you hawk five over like the biggest thing there, everyone's just like, what? That's crazy. And it's just like, yeah. That's what roller blading's about, my man. That's why I love the roller blade. Just that feeling of like being different and being able to express yourself.